Hey, what's up, y'all? Today we're playing Witch's Doll. Let's go ahead and start this game up because I'm tired of that lightning. It's crazy. You turn down the volume in the game and the music low, but the lightning just so loud. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, it's a UE5 horror game. It looked real fucking good. You know what I'm saying? Real good. Is my screen... I thought my screen was dusty. I, like the, I saw an eyeball in the background and I saw like frost building up on my screen. I thought my shit was dusty. I was like... Uh, hello? A very affordable room for rent, but there's one catch. It's demons in there. Oh, yeah, and I forgot to mention the 50 people that went missing staying in that same room. It kind of remind me of this one game I played, uh, September seventh. I think that was that's what it was called. That game sucked. So if this made by the same person who made that, God bless America. This is the place. I must get inside before the storm. Well, you better go. I don't know why you talking to us. You know, for a game that's made on UE5, that that car look kind of cheap. Just saying. I need to pick up my belongings box from the back. It say hold whatever the fuck button that is. I, I was holding whatever the fuck button that was. It's like, I'm holding shift. I guess that shift they talking about. I'm holding shift, but it ain't, it ain't running faster. Yeah, this looked just like that September 7 game. That game was so shit, I swear. Hope for this game a lot better than that. But it looked just like that. It's orange. That game was orange. Hey, I wonder what's down there. I'll never know because I ain't stupid enough to go check. It look, it, I swear it looked just like, hey, I wonder what's in there. Huh, we'll never know. At least not yet. It looked just like September 7th. I got the chills, boy. So they say room for rent. Yeah. Oh, and another game I played. I forgot what that game was. That game scared the shit out of me, for real. Except not September 7th. September 7th was bad. It was another game I played. If I remember the name or if I can find it, I'll drop a link for that. I think y'all need to go watch that. That game scared the shit out of me. It's that puppy. So what floor are you staying on? Can't be the top. No, not penthouse. Well, some loaded in. Is this it? No, nah, that can't. Maybe. No, nah, that ain't it. I hear somebody cleaning. Cleaning lady. Cleaning ladies. <sighs> ma'am. My dear, your room is on the right. Thank you, ma'am. Have a good day. Please, later on, please don't be a demon. I would I won't hesitate to check karate chop your butt cheeks. Won't hesitate. It's so damn dark, though. You know what I'm saying? It's like real dark. And then sprint. I'm guessing they they got a sprint in this game, but it ain't work. I should place the box on the dressing table. Yeah, you should. Hey, you got a dog. No, that dog barking outside. Dog sounded a lot closer than it did. No, that ain't the dressing table. Dressing table. Dressing table. What the fuck dressing table you talking about? And can you put can you turn some lights on here? It's kind of damn dark. I'm just saying, dog. No. Nope. Wow, the light already on. Well, let's go relax. I mean, it's real homey in here. You know, for one person. 
it ain't bad. What is this mess? It's like someone left in a hurry. They did. The the other 50 people that stayed here before you, I should clean this place up a little. Yeah, the other people. Who was in here stacking cans? Somebody was in here stacking them cans. You don't see that. You don't find nothing suspicious about that. A, a random family with a baby and you ain't gonna do nothing about that picture? Dude. Dude, fuck. No. No. Give me a flashlight and then I'll consider going in there. But at this point, hell nah, cuz. Like, it ain't happening, bro. It ain't happening. No way. No way, Jose. So is this game gonna, like, take place in this apartment. Actually, you know what? It ain't even, it ain't shit important over there. I ain't going over there. It's not gonna happen. So, I mean, we got the trash unless I gotta go outside and throw the trash away. Maybe it's a light switch in here. I mean, it is some music playing. Yeah, it's a light switch. Is that trash? Damn, you got your computer set up like a boss. I hate that shit, though. You know what I'm saying? I mean, look, I'm all about that. But consider it like, what if you playing a game with some headphones on and you and your door closed? Yeah, it's closed. We're going we gonna to give it to him. His door closed, but then it open and he don't hear it open. Or what if it's open and he playing games or chilling and he exposed all that? It's like laying up a laying against the wall but your back towards the opening you know what i'm saying like we don't do that around here oh that's the music well yeah we we not stupid around here well i mean look for a cursed apartment it's got a lot of space in it for one person i mean even two people could stay in here it ain't bad it ain't bad I think that's all the trash, bro. I think that's all the trash. Hey, actually, you know what? That's probably not all the trash. It's kind of dumb how they ain't give me a damn flash. Like, it's so fucking dark. I mean, look at all this space, bro. It's so much damn space. This is the same house in September 7th. It's got to be the same house. It's just layered different. Yeah, this is the same damn house. They just switched it up. I mean, cigarette butts, a knife stabbed, and a glove. Yeah, you crazy if I would have been staying here. I mean, at this point, you ain't got no choice. But I wouldn't have stayed here. There's just no way. Well, I at least thought you was going to, you know, put the chairs down and set it up, make it look nice. I want to say that's all the fucking trash. Or maybe not. Yeah, we got to get rid of them old dishes. Got to make room for the new. Make sure you get rid of that damn old ass bread. The apartment looks clean enough. Now I should throw the garbage away. They smells ter They smells terrible. I just wish I had a damn flashlight. It's kind of crazy not having a flashlight. So we got to go back outside, huh? No? Yes, not. Is this the trash? Oh. All right. Well, ain't nothing like a good little trash run. What could go wrong, right? Hey, what could go wrong in my new cursed apartment? The old lady went to sleep because she's, you know, hey, you sweep a little bit. That's it. Hey, how about I look out the window and see if I see somebody staring back? Nope. Nobody yet, but I see them damn swings swinging. Yep. That's the start of it. How about we look out this window and see if we see somebody staring back? No, but I damn sure see them swing swinging. Watch, it's going to be the same thing as September 7th. I don't know why something, something telling me the same person who made that game made this game. It's just the same setup. Like straight up, it's the same exact setup. But I got more hopes in this game. It seemed like it might be scary. Especially consider how dark it is. Because they ain't showing me shit. It's the same damn setup. It's the same map. 
Go watch me play that game. I'm dead ass serious. Go watch me play it. It's crazy. Ain't no old ladies out there, huh? I got a long damn way. Considering how slow I walk, I got a long damn way. I mean, damn. I mean, damn. The storm had gotten worse. I should throw the garbage out and get back fast. You gotta run fast. Damn, I can't throw it from here. I don't wanna go by the curse swings. Uh, no. No. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. They thought I was going to be a dumbass. They thought Steppy Peppy, Steppy Le Peppy was going to go over there and check. No, no. Oh, no. Me? No, no, no. Me no do that. Me no do that. I ain't no dumbass. I ain't I done played one too many damn games. Hey, when there's candy, you don't go for the candy. Some people might go for the candy. But never go for the candy. Never go full retard. Hey, man. Robert Downey said it best. You never go full retard. You never do it. If you do it, they're going to catch you. And who is they? You, you don't want to know. Because they're going to get your ass. They is going to get your ass. I'm looking for that old ass lady. Old lady? No, oh, I thought her apartment was open. Well, I mean, so far, shit, so far so good. I'm safe. That shit was kind of scary. I ain't even gonna lie. Since all the lights go off, couldn't tell me that was a storm doing that. No way. No way. No way. So what's your mission now, big dog? Unless you want to go do some work. I should start working. Yeah, I was like, you maybe you maybe want to do some work. And we're gonna close. Oh no, he a dumbass nigga. Oh my god, this nigga want to work with the door open. Who does that? Like dead ass. Who does that? I don't even do that. Look, there's three things I don't do. I don't sleep with the door open. I don't work with the door open, and I damn sure don't man, man, man with the door open. You know what I'm saying? You just don't do it. You just don't do it. And now oh, what the fuck? Oh. Why is closed? That ain't happened. I ain't do that. A horror story. Oh, I like how he actually typing in real time. That's cool. The narrative starts with James. The fear. I'm gonna zoom in for y'all. The guy behind a well-known horror tale, horror tale channel, deciding to focus his next nocturnal investigation on the infamously abandoned Crimson Hill Hospital. James is well known for his minimalist style and the only thing that has helped him on these scary expeditions is it's truly his trusty vhs camera which has recorded more ghosts and shadows than anyone was capable of uh, years have passed since the crimson hill hospital was abandoned following room rooms of horrifying atrocities and cruel experiments performed on his patients however recent reports of frightening noises and strange appearances have gone fresh have given fresh life to the old stories making it a an ideal topic for james's upcoming blog dun 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 oh. hey james big dog you don't see nothing wrong with that you 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 don't you don't want to Bro, you, you don't want to get... Sorry, y'all. Well, you can't expect me to turn around this time. I'm not turning around. It's not going to happen. Ah! All right, I did it. I mean, look. If you're going to have that popping up, can you at least do some shit about it? It's taking too long. Oh my God. Hey. That was the old lady. Oh my God, it was so scary. Uh, I, need some, I need some milk. I need some milk. Hey, who making all that noise in my fucking apartment? 
Uh, first off. Yeah, you want to... Why the fuck the lighter keep going off? Just give me a fucking flashlight then. See, the damn light keep going. All right, you know what? Fuck you. I ain't going. I ain't playing. Why the goddamn lighter keep? Oh, cause the window blowing it out. Doy. See, what well, I'm trying to. I'm trying to get over there. They won't let me get over there. There we go. Oh, because the damn table was in a way. Yeah, Steph, you got to find a way around me. I'm the table in here. I'm the haunted table. They didn't tell you about me. I'm the Drew villain. It's like, well, that's what you want me to believe, big dog. Yeah, man. I'm like, I would have been left that bitch. This apartment. Where all these damn doors came from? I don't remember so many doors being in my apartment. Nope. Bro, I did as don't remember all these daughters being in my apartment. This apartment is very big, yes. Very big indeed. Very big indeed. This apartment is very big. It's almost how you say in America too damn big it's too damn big and haunted very haunted very fucking haunted so maybe we gotta check the power I doubt your power gonna work big dog but we can try wherever the damn box is I think the box might be in the hallway yeah right here the fuse are burnt out there must be some spare ones around here that I can use well like in the, the, the over here by the kitchen no? Huh? You ever thought about that tough guy? Nope. Nope. Not happening. Not turning around, sir. It's not gonna happen. It'll never happen. I'll never turn around. Somebody just emailed me about their game. A whole box of conveniently placed fuses. Like a boss. Alright. Now who opened that door over here? Cause I'm most definitely coming over there to check. I'm all, I'm all in this, like dead ass. I'm in this. I'm in it. I ain't even scared. I'm just like, I'm ready for it. I want you to take me. Ladies? Is that the bait? Nope. <laughs> I saw darkness. And I was like, it's darkness. I'm used to that at this point. But then I saw it going down and I was like, oh, that's the basement. I'll never go down there. Nope. One at a time? That's retarded. Oh, shit. Hold up. How about we take one from that? Is it a puzzle? Well, I mean... It can't be a fucking puzzle, is it? This is bullshit. My God. It's that thing they call sabotage. Or sabotage, like I like to call it. I guess they want me to go in the fucking basement. I'm going in the... Ba Wait a minute. X6 times 6. That's 6. Blank equals 53. Oh, you got to add it up to 53. So what we got? One plus. I got to do math, y'all. This is bullshit. I got to. Not only am I in a cursed apartment, but I got to do math in it. 34. 42. 48. 49. Yeah. Damn, that took a long ass time to fucking do, bro. That took a long ass time. Oh, I thought I saw somebody. Anybody behind me? No, uh, no, you ain't you ain't about that life. You ain't about that life, though. I think they want me to go in the basement. Think they want me to go in the basement, but I ain't going in the basement. There's no way you can't maybe go in the basement. I like that puzzle though. That was pretty dope. You know what I'm saying? It was just getting on my nerves, dog. Like straight up. So no work for me right now. I'm. I think I gotta go in the fucking basement. So we going in the fucking basement. I would, you know what I'm saying? Like, I wish they would have gave me a damn flashlight. It's like, why do these games want to rely on a fucking lighter? Make it modern. You know what I'm saying? Give me a fucking flashlight. There's nothing wrong with giving a flashlight. I think you would serve a lot better if you would just give me a flashlight. On to the basement. Oh, it's not the basement. Thank God. So what is this? Is this another living room? Or is this storage? This storage. Oh, fuck no. 
Now, look, I don't know how the hell you got here, but you need to leave. You need to leave. This is my apartment now. All right? You need to go. Fucking tarot card. Which one is it? The moon. I don't even know what that means. Please leave. I'm going to tell you that one time. Please don't close. Don't close. Don't close. Don't close. All right, we good. Where we going? I got to go to my bedroom? Nope. Hey, 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 where the hell my bedroom at? Hey, it's got to be something else in here. Unless you want me to pick up that little creepy ass dog. You want me to pick that little bitch up? I tried. Hey, I'm going to get on your level. You got some real dirty feet. You need to go take a shower. If you're going to stay here, you got to take a shower. You got to clean yourself. Man, I don't want to see you later. I swear. I swear on me, mom. I don't want to see your ass later. So I'm going to go ahead and close you in there. Then maybe we got to go to the bathroom. I just don't want to do it. There's no reason to go in the bathroom. Anything in the key? Thank you. Thank you. Get a fucking flashlight, my nigga. Get a fucking flashlight, my bros. Yeah, get a fucking flashlight. It's so hot. Man, it's so hot. Summertime is beating my ass, boy. Summertime, look, it's the it's the complete opposite of what Superman go through. Where's my flashlight? I left it right here. I don't know. I guess you got to go in detective mode. Hey, I think I know who took it. Let's go see that little creepy ass dog again. Hey. All right, then. Guess I'm skipping the dog for now. For now. For now. Who in here breaking my plates and shit? If you ain't buy it, don't break it. Because I ain't buy it either. But you don't see me breaking it. So I want nothing in here. I heard some plates break. I ain't crazy. Unless maybe that wasn't in here. Maybe that was in that other room. But no, that came from in here. It came from in here. All right, then. Well, so be it. So be it. I'm kind of looking down because I don't want to get scared. Put my head in here. Doll? I heard you was talking shit. Oh, get it? Oh, shit. It's gone. Yep. I hate that flashlight. I mean, I like it because it, 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 it worked like a real flashlight. It's, it's long and it's somewhat wide, but it don't give off as much as you hope. You know what I'm saying? It's real atmospheric. That fucking dog gone, bro. This is label shit. Uh, you trying to, the screams must have come from the old lady's apartment. What make you think that? What make you think, hmm, if I deduce two plus two, that it's coming from that old lady apartment. What make you think that? Even if it did come from that old lady apartment. So, that ain't got nothing to do with me. And then my thing is, after what he done seen, he ain't freak out. See, like you gotta make you gotta make your games make sense, big dog. It's like he saw he was working and the thing flashing on his monitor you know what i'm saying like the little crazy looking scary poster flash on his monitor he turned around to see a thing which looked like the old lady and then power go off he see a creepy ass dog in the storage room he go back in there it's gone but oh what's that what happened before that something took his flashlight out his box it's like you got to make sense of that shit you know what i'm saying now we got to go see this damn old lady who probably did where could an old lady hide a spare key? I don't know. Maybe under the fucking mat. Yeah. Like anybody else. Yo, I dead ass don't want to fucking go in here. I promise y'all. I really don't want to go in here. Old lady, look. I swear. Your apartment is great as fuck. Like dead ass. Your apartment is extremely great. This place seems to have been abandoned for you. Yeah, because that old lady was dead. The whole damn building's been dead and abandoned. And you stay here. Oh. 
I'm scared. No. I hate that shit. I hate this whole fucking... I don't even know what to say. What's in here? I'm checking, y'all. You know what's crazy? It's like, I thought about this a few times over the course of doing YouTube. You know, when I'm in these games, I play them, and as and each step I take when some scary shit happening, I feel myself hesitate like I'm doing right now and I'm stalling. And then when I get done recording the game, I look back and I think to myself, how did I manage to get through that? Because it add on to my catalog of horror games. You know what I'm saying? And it's different. It's always fucking different. Excuse me? Well, that's locked. Probably don't even want to go in there anyway. I just, just fucking scared, dog. I'm, oh my God, I'm shaking. I'm shaking. I can't even breathe in. I can't even breathe out and breathe in. Oh, you need two keys for that. Is do the game got different enters in it? I want to say the game got different enters in it. Why are you here? Like dead ass. Why are you here? Well, it's to be honest, it's kind of too late. You already locked in here. But let's be a hundred, bro. Why are you here? I swear to God. I swear to God. I swear to God. I swear. What is that? That's the old lady, bro. Pretty sure she's gonna be behind your ass. Hey, another tarot card. The sun. Got another tarot card. I came over here for a fucking card. What the hell them tarot cards mean? <sighs> My god. I'm terrified. I don't know if y'all can hear it. But I heard somebody. I don't know if they was crying or if they was talking. But I heard somebody. Yep. She crying. Let's just do it. I don't even at this point. Baby. Man, this is bullshit. I wouldn't have came in here, dog. Hey, a peephole. All right. Oh man, y'all notice how like the closer I get to the hole, the deeper her voice get, the deeper and slower it get. But when I'm far away, she sounds like an old lady crying. That is fucking crazy. I'm coming to see you. Man, I swear to God, I wouldn't have did it. I wouldn't have. I wouldn't have came here. I'd rather live on the streets. Old lady. Well, somebody behind me. Oh, lady. Oh, lady. That's a big ass hole. That hole wasn't that big. Oh, shit, bro. Oh, she looking. Oh, my God.
That's not me zooming in. That's the game. I just don't want to play. I really don't want to play this fucking game, bro. Like, I swear to God. Like, it's, it's something different when you play a game. Look, like, playing a game, anybody can play a horror game. Anybody. Anybody can play a horror game through a damn TV with speakers. But you can't. It ain't a lot of people out there that can play a game with headphones on. You know how some people watch a movie and be like, oh, it's not scary. That's because you watching it first off from a distance and you probably watching it on a laptop or some shit. But when you watch a movie, a horror movie with some headphones on, it's, it's atmosphere. You know what I'm saying? It's like it's different ways to watch and experience things, but you got to do it the right way. That wasn't scary. Arrow cut? No, that's a note. My heart can't. Is that a peep? The fuck? I need to read that. My heart can't bear this loss. I miss my daughter so much. When I fall asleep, I still see her face. I fear that one day I'll wake up and forget how she looks like. It's been years. I wish I could do something to see her once more, to take another look at her face again. Maybe. Maybe I could do something. This old book from my mother's attic after she died. I can use it to see my daughter again. I always found that book foolish, but it's worth trying. And like a dumbass. You tried it. And like a dumbass. Wait a minute. You got an attic in here? I got to go in it? I don't want to go in no attic. You crazy. No, I'm leaving. This is my chance. Wait a minute. This is my chance. My one true chance. Fuck. If I was an attic, where would I be? Not like an attic. You know what I'm saying? Like somebody addicted to some shit. But if I was an attic, you know? Like the opposite of a ba the The brother of a basement. Well, I mean, if if the attic, God, I'm gonna keep walking. If the attic and the basement is two different things, well, clearly they two different things. But what would what gender would they be? You know what I'm saying? Like, let's keep it a buck. What gender would the attic and the basement be? Anybody? Can't go in. I need keys. Oh, don't tell me it's gonna be a cold. And you, it's something gonna be up with this this wedding dress because it's got a knife in it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that wedding dress gonna fucking chase after me. It remind me of was it was it one of them Annabelle movies where the the damn wedding dress was a demon, like it was a demon in the wedding dress, and it and then that scene with the hallway where it was the the tall lady was wearing the wedding dress and she fucked around and started like walking towards the girl through the hallway. That shit was so damn scary. Late night when you need my hey got some candle got some candle for what though don't tell me you gotta do a ritual though like really this is what you're doing now you're doing a ritual this is what we're doing now oh I gotta light the candles shit Ooh. oh my god Damn, I didn't know what was happening. That's two. I think it was like a billion candles in there. Well, you already know one going here. I hate that dress. I If they don't, look, I'm going to be real disappointed if the dev ain't set up a scare for that wedding dress. I'm going to be mad disappointed, bro. Like mad disappointed. You're going you gonna to see fire and brimstone come out the disappointment I'm going to be throwing at you. Because you got a real good setup for, like, a scary-ass situation. Like, I ain't even lying to you, dog. So, since we got to set up the candles, I'm pretty sure it's another one in the hallway somewhere. Wait, in the living room. But I ain't going to take care of that one yet. I'm going to wait. I'm going to come back in here. Yeah, there go another one. Is it another one in here? No, you got fucking urns and shit. Ladies, ladies, number six or five. I think it's number five. Number five. There's got to be one more. Or maybe not. Maybe that was it. Ladies. Lid in that picture too. If you don't do nothing with that picture, I'm gonna be upset. Ladies. Hey. 
And whatever happened to the doll? I really wanted to see the doll. Man, I came over here just to turn it off. If that, I would have just left it on. I would have left it on. Oh, you not going to, yeah. I thought so. That was kind of whack, though. You should have waited until I got closer. That was kind of whack sauce. Oh, I see you. Can I pick you up? Can I pick you up, dog? No, I can't. So what was the point of lighting the candles? And I like how he's just going along with this instead of freaking out. That's that's bad narrative. That's in that room. Yeah, that's bad narrative. You gotta have him freaking out, you know what I'm saying? Like have him trying to escape. Cause at this point it seemed like he welcoming this shit. Oh no. She got a knife in her back. Somebody betrayed her. Hey, are you the woman in black? I like your movies. The f the second one, not so much, but the first one was pretty good. I really hope you don't kill me. <sighs> Who you dancing with? Well, you ain't close it. Oh, you should have. Man, look. One day, I'm going to make a horror game. I've been thinking about that for some years, but one day, I'm going to make a horror game. You know what they should have did? Kind of like that scene in the first. I think it might be the first Annabelle movie. Where the little girl was standing in the hall in the other room. The lady was watching her from another room. The little girl started running. And as the as the door started closing, then out of nowhere, the, the little girl turned into a grown-ass woman and started running at the lady. That's what I thought they was going to do. Had me walking towards the door. The door closed. As I opened it, the old lady run at me. You know what I'm saying? That would have scared the shit out of me, dog. That's that fucking dog. I was just talking about you. I was just talking about you, blood. That's the piano. I gotta, I'm gotta. i going to take a picture of that. That's the piano. Call me. I'm a, all right, you just stay there. You look pretty, all right? So what we got? 24767642531. Four, I ain't going to cap, though. You could have did a better job with that. There's a song that I used to play on the piano for my daughter. She loved it. She loved it so much that she danced like a fairy. My beloved daughter. Wish I could play this song for you again. Just one last time. There you go. I did it. Hope you're having a good time. Oh, a key. That's only one key, though. Oh, wait a minute. What if it go right here? Nah. All right, then. Don't scare me. Don't scare me. Oh shit. Oh shit, dog. That's only one. <sighs> Fuck it. One, two, three. Oh. Hey, who's that watching them statics in there? I heard that was a good TV show. Wow. That was kind of dope. I just pulled a, a damn key out of TV. Well, you know when that happened, it's going to be some scary shit. Nah, you're crazy. Like that. Like that. Like that. Like that. Man, they and you know what? I appreciate them. They setting up for some of that. Oh, never mind. I can see her. I can see her again. I saw her. She was right there. I had pictured her. I pictured her, and she was looking at me right into my eyes. My beloved daughter, you, you haven't changed a bit. You're the same as the last time we were together, just like the last time you were with me alive. Now, look, who, who the hell is the daughter? Is the old lady the daughter or the, the, the mom? And who was the, you know, the, the lady in black, the one that was dancing? You crazy. Don't don't make me use that bullshit camera. I gotta take pictures. This is fucking bullshit. 
So the first picture, I don't know where that's at. I gotta take a picture, it looked like a doorway. It looked like that doorway. Oh no. I see what they doing. Oh no. What's the next one? So you're not going to... Yeah, there we go. Is that making a key? That's making a fucking key, ain't it? That's the bedroom. Oh, I know what I said. That's that. That's why I had to crouch. The whole back and forth thing is probably getting on my nerves with that picture thing. Oh, no. They're going to do it. The whole picture, the portrait on the wall, they're going to do it, y'all. They're going to do it. Thank the nun. When the nun, you know, the picture, the portrait on the wall, and she grabbed it and ran. Yep, I know. I don't want... Uh, the fuck is that? Hey. Mannequin? Wait a minute. Huh? What if I... I gotta take a picture of you? Nah. How the hell I get you out my way? Oh, I see. Every time I take a picture of her, she looks like she wants to talk to me, but I can't hear her. She seems to be in pain. All right. I'm going to go ahead and assume you're not behind me. All right. I don't know what the hell that knock was. It could have been my feet. I'm going to take a picture on the ground. Nah, bullshit. That was it. Stand up, nigga. Yeah. Uh, real dirty. Real doity. Real doity. Doity bed, doity. Real doity. You used to call me. Oh, you back in the thing. You used to call me on my brick phone. So what's the next one? This is bullshit. I ain't even lying to y'all. This is bullshit. This is extreme bullshit. This is bullshit extreme old. This is bullshit if bullshit had emotions and a personality. There you go. Two more. Where could number three be? Where the fuck is number three? See, I wish I could zoom in. Number three look like it's in the living room. What's in the red room? Oh, is that it? Nah, that it can't be it. Is it in here? Yeah, 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 yeah. It's a whole lot of blood. Whole lot of blood, blood. Whole lot of blood, blood. Whole lot of blood. You gotta get you some. You gotta get you some. Get you some blood. Get you some blood. Blood. Get you some. Get you some damn blood. Blood. Number three coming up. And then it takes too long for shit to happen. You know what I'm saying? Certain things. Certain things. One more. My God, it's happening, people. Oh, this is bullshit. They doing it. They doing it. And then you know it's fucked up when I take when I take turn the light off. Let me let me see how pitch black. Well, then again, no, it's a candle over there. But no, this is bullshit. Oh no, that's so fucking dark, bro. I'm coming for you. And I want it all, too. I'm, gonna, I'm stopping right here. Fuck this shit. Oh, they want me to get close. All right. It's as close as I'm getting. Oh, you want me to get even closer? Bro, I, 
swear to God. Ah, oh, fuck. All right, let's do this. That was almost as good as I was expecting. I wish it would have ran at me, though. They setting up for some real good thumbnails, though. Like, straight up. I mean, some good-ass thumbnails. Oh, boy, this game good. This is a good game. And it's mainly atmosphere that's getting me. Jump scares really don't get me these days. I'm all about atmosphere. I'm all about controlling my, my, my emotions and controlling, you know, what I can and can't do. And just making the game atmospheric. Trapping me. Making me go certain ways. Making me do certain shit like what we just did. You know what I'm saying? That kind of stuff fuck me up. Like real talk. Making me check a room I don't want to check. I try so hard to avoid it and then I can't do it. Nah. Jump scare is real cheap these days. I appreciate it. I'm appreciating this game because it's just atmosphere. Now, what's in here? That's a big ass mirror. It, there's no way. I gotta like this. Oh no! Don't tell me you wanna. That's a big ass pencil. Don't tell me you want me to play. Don't tell me. What the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? What the fuck? What is that? Don't tell me you want me to play. Don't tell me you want to play Bloody Mary. I'm clicking. Because I don't know what to do. Oh, it's drawers. Oh. Anything? Got a comb. No, I don't. I thought I had a comb. I got to play music? Nah, because ain't no vinyl on there. Oh. I found this old gramophone near that old book from my mother's attic. The vinyl contains some kind of instructions on how to speak to a dead spirit. I must follow the instructions very carefully. Perhaps this way I can speak with my daughter again. Bunch of dumbasses. Bunch of damn dumbasses always trying to... Get, look, I get it. People die. And people get sad. But I mean, come on, bro. You don't need to be trying to speak to the dead. Why we as humans try to be speaking to the dead? This is a guide on how to speak with the spirit that has reached the gates of the spirit world. Be aware that you must follow all the instructions very carefully, and if it corrects them, the mistake can lead to disaster and possibly I'm probably gonna die anyway, bro. I got a big ass mirror in front of me. So I got a Ouija board. I got a Ouija board. And they said something about offerings. Oh, a cone. Guess not. Then he said the, the, the mirror revealed a fucking eyeball. What? Oh, shit. Beep. Be beep. 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 I gotta take a picture. I did that. Oh, hey. They all got pictures on them. For what? Oh. So it's. How you, how you do the whole like mouse click thing? Cause I can't, can I, can I mess with the numbers? I can't mess with the numbers. At least not yet. Maybe I can't do it yet. I gotta take a picture of these. Yep. All right, I got numbers. So we got D5, A3. Oh, shit. I know what I got to do. 
Let's see. The eight. So we got three, two, three, two, eight. 3285 3285 6 32856 that's 32856 I ain't dumb really don't tell my boy the game out so B is 2 C is 8 that's an 8 I know an 8 when I say 8 that's an 8 oh 328 oh my god 328532 Three two eight five six. Three two wait. Three two eight. Three two eight five. Three two eight five six. Yeah. Three two eight five six. Three two eight five six. That ain't it. All right, y'all. I had to look this part up because it was confusing. I guess it's a mirror thing. You know what I'm saying? So it's eight five six eight five eight five two six three. Yeah, I, I guess it's a mirror thing. I don't know how the hell that makes sense, but it is what it is. That took me a little too long. Let's go ahead and get that. Next clue, please. See, hold up. I hear what you're saying, but what in the hell do I need to talk to the daughter for? Why? What's the point of me talking to the daughter? I ain't got nothing to do with this. Why am I here? I did it. What's next? A picture? Oh, that is crazy. I tried that. I mean, let's be real. What the fuck? Like, why am I doing this, bro? Like, it ain't no reason for me to be doing this. Huh? Huh? Bro, I swear to God, this is bullshit. This character is dumb as fuck. I don't want to speak. Hey, look, I shouldn't even be here. I came here to start a fresh new life, man. I had a new apartment. I get it. You know, he, he make horror novels and shit. Maybe he needs some inspiration, but damn. My God, it's so many. Is someone here with me right now? I don't know. How about you ask the 50 billion spirits in the room with you? Honestly, you ain't need to ask that. You could have just looked in the room and saw the whole party in here with you. Are you tied to an object? What I think you should be asking is, am I about to die? Uh, if yes, which object are you tied to? Honestly, I don't think they tied to an object. I think they tied to you. Once you step foot in the apartment, I think that's what... D D O Doll Doll What are you seeking? It's either life or it's death. It ain't no in between. F F L Flesh I told you life they they want his life I think you need to get the hell out of that apartment I mean the whole building Are you the daughter that's a big 10 for no, sir. Hey, 
Are you the daughter? Yeah, that's a big no. That's a big ass no, sir. I think you need to get the fuck out of there. I like how he was just sitting there. Bullshit, 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 bullshit. Oh my god, bro. What the fuck? 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 Oh. Oh, you got a special face. No, you got the same face. But you missing an arm, though. No, you're not. You're just holding some shit. What you holding? What's that? Basement key. God damn. Oh, that's the, the, the room downstairs. Oh, yeah. They want me to see the dead body. Nah. That was a that wasn't that was pretty ripe. Not ripe. That's the wrong word. That was pretty stale. See, that's what I mean. Jump scares don't really fuck with me like that. Atmosphere get me. Well, that's bold. Where y'all came from? Nice ass. I just had to put that out there. Yeah. Well, we gotta go all the way downstairs, y'all. Gotta go see some people. Gotta go see somebody. And you know, I guess these mannequins represent all the dead people that died here. They got to. It's like, what why, What other reason you got to have mannequins in this damn building? And I like the ambiance. You feel me? The humming, the thumping in the background. I don't know why that. Why, 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 why you doing that? Why you do that? How can she slap? One of y'all gonna attack me and I'm gonna punch your ass right in the face. I'm gonna punch you right in the nose. Nope. You crazy. You crazy. That thing head was shaking. I know I ain't. Oh, I missed that. Well, you probably wouldn't have got me anyway. Almost there, y'all. Hey, you're not the one that was messing with me upstairs, right? Here we go. This is D1. Oh, no, we still going down. Oh, shit. Here we go. This is D1. Oh, man, it's real goopy in here. Man. I'm probably gonna find a coffin in here. I'm dead ass probably gonna find a coffin in this damn basement. Probably gonna find a damn Oh, look at that. Blood. I get why they ain't got sprint. I do. I get it. Oh fucking hell. What the fuck? Man, you know, I thought he was sitting on top of that box. Why? This is fucking bullshit. You just had to break the light, huh? Just had to break my light. Now, how it broke? Did you drop it? Now don't don't drop that on your face. Yo, I'm pretty sure whatever you letting out. I'm pretty sure whatever you letting out really don't need to be let out. All right, I'm just saying. I really wouldn't. Have, I wouldn't have did that. I wouldn't have did that. I would have. I would have stayed. I'm telling y'all, like, this is such a dumbass game in terms of, like, the narrative. Why the f why the, why is he doing this? 
It don't make sense. Oh, no, it's Blair Witch all over again. Oh, shit. Oh, my God, bro. That scared the fuck out of me. Oh, that got me. That got me. Yep, that got me. I wasn't expecting that. Small key. Hell, if I know. Oh, my God. I think it was another way to the left. You gotta ask yourself. Well, ain't no going back from here. You gotta ask yourself. Fuck no. Yo, oh shit, dude. This chain is very uncomfortable, but I can't remove it. It bears a strange symbol along with a number. Perhaps the number indicates the current number of victims, but I don't know what the symbol means. I don't even know what you're talking about. Can I just grab the knife out you and use it? Yeah, hopefully I don't need to remember whatever they talking about because I ain't see it. I hear you crying. You want to stop all that damn crying? Uh, mannequin. Itty mannequin. Oh. I might have to. I ain't gonna lie. I might. Have, I'm gonna. I'm gonna just brute force it. Yep. Yeah, I'm just gonna brute force it, y'all. That boy. All right. So we need some symbols. I tried brute forcing it. It ain't work. So if I was some symbols, where would I be? Oh, on his foot. Nine. I don't know what that means. Maybe I gotta make that symbol. I probably gotta make that symbol. I should have took a picture of that. But I'm gonna I'm gonna try to remember that. I think I can remember that. Oh shit, I did it. Damn. That was cake. That was pretty cake. Damn, I ain't even have to jump cut for that. I was almost there. Oh, it's got physics. My God. My God, guys. It's physics. What's that? You making noise? What the fuck is that? Don't tell me I gotta sneak. Oh my god. What the fuck is that? He banging his head on that. Well, I guess I'm coming to see you. Oi, what you doing, mate? Stop banging your head on that, yeah? So I can't. Well, I tried to get him to stop. Oh, I got to take a picture of your ass, huh? Spoink. Oh, my God. Brother ain't like that. He don't like when people take picture. So what's that? It look like an arrow, but nah, it's probably just blood leaking down tried he tried who tried he tried to hurt he tried to hurt oh shit he tried to hurt her the, the old lady is crazy her daughter's gone gone forever the dog is playing with her mind it's rotting her brain this thing is not her daughter it's something much darker i must destroy it maybe this way i can escape from this place all right i guess i'm going this way 
going down to the deeper basement we going to the basement times two the double basement i see your ass see that's kind of crazy how i gotta crouch you looking at me real goopy in here real mcgoopy in here oh i gotta burn this shit huh well i mean if 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 i had to burn it i would have took that i don't know why they ain't let me take the gas maybe i gotta backtrack man that was kind of wack you gave it away with the whole my camera kind of tilting a little bit if you would have just had a is she dancing she's still dancing y'all Oh no, that was a chain dancing. Thought I saw the lady in black dancing. Yeah, they starting to get desperate for scares. They starting to throw a bunch of jump scares at me. The hell is this? <sighs> oh, it's that freaking doll. What's up, blood? All right, don't move again. Have to snatch you up. I visited my daughter's grave every single day. I couldn't bear the thought of her being away from me, away from her home. I had to dig up a grave and bring her bones here back to her beloved home. I think you need to come with me. Guess not. So how you want me to do that? How you want me to get rid of the damn thing? Well, hey, there go that coffin I said I was probably gonna see. So how you want me to get rid of the damn thing? I gotta burn it. I gotta burn that bitch, huh? I'll be back. Oh, shit. Knock my ass out. It's not your daughter, though. It's not your daughter, baby. It's not your daughter. I think at this point the game kind of dragging on a little bit, but that's just me. Damn, a few days. Oh no, another victim, my God. I really hope this game coming to an end because if it's gonna be the, if it's gonna be like another 20, 30 minutes of this same shit, it's gonna be kind of, it's gonna drag on and get kind of wax sauce. How about we look out the window? Well, them swings not swinging. And I wonder how people be hearing about this apartment. They should have had somebody staring at me from out there. I wonder how they be hearing about what, Craigslist? Yelp? Like, real talk. How they be hearing about the apartment, dog? Like, let's be real. Who just be showing them the damn apartment? Like, hey, we got this real affordable, cheap, affordable apartment. No catches. Just very affordable. You can't beat these prices, people. Come get it while you, while it's available. And it's always available. And then you die. Yeah. Oh, hell no. Good game. Good game. I give it to him. Good fucking game. Good game. Good game. Good game. I want to get out that music though, but I'm going to wait till the credits go by and then I'll talk to y'all. All right. Well, that was some quick ass credits. I wasn't expecting them to be so quick. So.
So that was the game. Hope y'all had a good time watching me play that. Hey, look, that was real dope. You know what I'm saying? That was a real dope game. I'm going to turn it down, though. Real good game. It was scary as hell. What what got me was just the, the atmosphere. You know what I'm saying? It was just a real atmospheric game. The tension, the unexpected situations where you you – you you think this and then something else happened. Even though I did call some things, cause I don't played enough horror games to know what's gonna happen and what's not gonna happen. But I like this game. I think it was a little too slow though. It was like real slow. The fact that you walk and you can't you can't sprint that kind of pissed me off. And, and what's crazy is I think at the beginning, I think they show sprint. I'm probably wrong on that. I don't know what them two arrows is, but yeah, I think that was whole shift and sprint. I think my 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 least favorite thing about this game though was the story. It ain't make no sense. It's like I'm this person who I guess want a fresh start, and I go in this apartment building that's abandoned. I don't know that, and then like from the jump, things start happening. Once I get to the apartment and I clean it up, I go outside to throw the trash away. The thing, the lights go off. You know what I'm saying? The lights start flashing in the distance. I turn around to go back to the apartment. The lights go off. And at that point, scary shit just started happening. It just, it ain't make sense. As you, like, I get it. You know, people play off the the lack of common sense when it comes to game characters and horror games and horror movies. They dumb. They stupid. They don't know how to think. They don't know how, they, 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 they ain't got no kind of survival awareness. They don't think danger Oh, let me turn around and leave. No, they got to keep going for the sake of a story. But even with this game, I think it was just a little too damn dumb. You know what I'm saying with the story? It's like this dude, I ain't seen not one section of, you know, dialogue or subtitles that popped up where it was saying, I got to get out of here. I got to leave. This is too much. What the hell is going on? It, he was just going along with it. You know what I'm saying? And that kind of pissed me off because I'm like, dude. From the jump, shit was happening. You sitting at your desk working, all of a sudden, you see this thing pop up on your monitor and you turn around and see an old lady just staring at you and she creepy, then the power go off. Doors opening on their own, creepy ass dog, your flashlight disappear, and you ain't got nothing to say about that. It was just lazy writing, you know what I'm saying? I wish they would have made it make more sense. I think towards the end, maybe at the last 15, 20 minutes, they start getting desperate. You know what I'm saying? I think at that point, they was kind of wrapping the game up, so they was just throwing a bunch of jump scares at you. But I wish they wouldn't have did that, especially knowing the game kind of dragged on. I mean, it wasn't nothing but an hour and a half, but it kind of dragged on a little bit. I wish they would have, you know, kind of cut back on a lot of that walking because it was pretty much a walking simulator. But it, it just kind of dragged on for all that walking that you do in it. And I think towards the end, like I said, too many jump scares. Way too many jump scares. You was killing me with the atmosphere. At times, I couldn't even breathe. At times, I was struggling to breathe. At times, I was I dead ass ain't want to keep playing because I was so scared. But then once I noticed all them jump scares like in the apartment, the old lady apartment, that's when it really kicked in. Now they starting to throw too many jump scares at me and it's not that scared. Honestly, I think that's it. The game was scary. It was just real scared. You feel me? And as far as the old lady go, I really don't know what the hell was going on with her. I don't know who she was. I don't know what the hell her deal was. I mean, she was just some old lady who lost her daughter, and she, you know, prayed to some demons and shit like that, used a Ouija board, and got back in touch with her daughter. But I guess she died in the house. She probably lost her soul in the house, or she killed herself to see her daughter. Maybe them demons convinced her, hey, if you kill yourself, you can have your daughter again. But her daughter was in that doll. What her daughter was in the doll. Her daughter wasn't in the doll. The demon convinced her her daughter was in the doll. You know, it's kind of like Annabelle. You know what I'm saying? But that old lady kind of reminded me of the lady in black. I like the puzzles in the game. It was pretty dope. Like the whole fuse thing at the beginning. That was cool. You know, the whole picture thing was that was probably the most confusing puzzle for me. You know, when you before you start using a Ouija board and you you took a, you take a picture of them shadow pictures, and they want you to put the numbers on that lock. That was kind of retarded because it ain't make sense. I guess it was a reverse thing, but it ain't make sense. If you're going to have letters by the numbers, then make sure they go in order and they ain't just in some random ass order. But that's all I got. It was a good game. I ain't going to take it away from it. Scared the shit out of me. If y'all want to try it, I'll drop a link for it. If you want to see, see September 7th, I'll drop a link for that. That was the complete opposite of what this game did. But in the meantime, that's it. Go check that video out. Go check this game out. And thanks for watching.